The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. So let's say we're given an isosceles triangle with a vertex angle that measures x degrees and a base angle that measures 70 degrees and we're asked to find the value of x. Remember that the isosceles triangle theorem states that if two sides of a triangle are congruent, then the angles opposite those sides are congruent. So here, since we have two congruent sides and the angle opposite one of the congruent sides measures 70 degrees, then we know that the other angle opposite the other congruent side must also measure 70 degrees. Now to find the value of x, remember that the sum of the measures of the angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. So we can set up the equation x plus 70 plus 70 equals 180. Simplifying on the left side, 70 plus 70 is 140, so we have x plus 140 equals 180. And subtracting 140 from both sides, we find that x equals 40. So the angles of this isosceles triangle measure 70, 70, and 40 degrees. 